Bengals, and the Bills are actually tied. Then CJ and the Texans. Mm. Uh, Baltimore, the Chiefs' prime primary competition. Can we be honest here? You no, know, we should. <laughs> in in the AFC, there is no competition. They are. You guys, you guys can say. Ah. Here's the facts. <laughs> if not for the one objectively bad half of football Patrick Mahomes has played as an NFL starter, the Chiefs would have won this conference five years in a row. Yeah, I mean, five, five years in a row. Be, uh, and so instead, they had to settle for winning it four of the last five and losing in overtime in the one in the middle. The Chiefs have eliminated from the postseason either directly or by proxy of whooping their ass in the division so many times they don't make the postseason. Every team in the AFC in Mahomes' tenure, except for the two teams that never make the postseason, the Jets and the Patriots. Every other one, the Dolphins, the Bills, the entire AFC North, they've gotten, the entire AFC South, they've gotten, and the entire AFC West. When this start? When are you drawing the line? The, the Chiefs, since Mahomes has been there, have knocked out of the postseason. Every team in the AFC North, every team in the okay. AFC South. We, we played the, the I'm just, I don't want the, to go back and do Patriots Mahomes. Stuff. Oh, I totally agree. The Patriots back when they were a relevant good okay, football team. Okay, but you team can't say were, they don't never knock out the Patriots. They, they can't I, accept the Patriots. Well, accept the I, Patriots because we okay. knocked you guys okay. out. Okay, all right. I'm going to have a Chiefs competition discussion that doesn't involve the Patriots. Well, then don't tell me you, you, Mahomes knocks out all the teams except the Patriots because I, when they played, Brady beat yeah, Mahomes. Yeah, yes, I That's understand what I'm saying. that. They, you can continue. I, 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 Okay, the point I was making that I think the audience understood was they have not, he's not going to get the opportunity to check them off the list okay. because they don't make the postseason. So I don't think they have a rival. Maybe Wilds well, thinks it's the Pats six I years ago. I'm not I'm just, <laughs> the, but it's, I don't think they have a rival. Pool. I'm just I'm trying not, to correct well, you. Look, they are clearly, they should be. I don't know if they are. They should be the favorites in AFC because they should be better than they were last year. Everything says they will. The defense more experienced. The offense, now you got some real speed, some real receivers. That should make them better. Um, but the facts are, Nick, they haven't won it five straight years, the, the conference, and no team has ever won three straight Super Bowls. But That's a huge fact over 100 years of NFL football. But they don't have to win a third Super Bowl this or year. Or I should say the Super Bowl era. Yeah, but they no, don't to make right, the Super Bowl. They just have to get there. Yeah. But uh, the AFC is the better conference, too. So, I look. If you want to, like I said, the Chiefs probably should be favored, but I think Baltimore is the biggest rival. I, look, I, I respect the Texans. I think they're going to be, you know, give them some trouble. I don't mean rival because they don't, they probably don't have a rival. People think of it as Buffalo or Cincinnati. Cincinnati is probably the Cincinnati biggest Cincinnati is one. the only one that I That's think close. can claim rival. Right. But Baltimore, you guys know, I think the defense, I can just check off, it's going to be top five. At worst, under Harbaugh, it's top ten. Sure. Okay. Offensively, I'm adding Derrick Henry, who's still running the football well. And we can talk about, oh, at a certain point, running backs aren't as good. Most running backs. There have been major exceptions, and I don't have to go back to the 1980s to find them, okay? So I think Derrick Henry still got a lot left. I think that's going to improve the offense from the running game to the passing game. To Lamar, why is he losing weight? Maybe it's some reason I don't know of, but I think it might be to be just a tad bit faster and run more like he did before. So I, I think that. Baltimore is going to be a, a legit I contender. In the in the AFC, or the number one contender for the Chiefs, but silver medalists. No, I'm. Their ceiling is silver medal. They can't beat Kansas City, so it's just automatic four Kansas City's yeah. winning AFC. I don't know. He's four. Lamar's four and one against them. Well, Burrow or had major way, success against yeah. Mahomes. I'm sorry, yeah. Lamar's one and and, four and then lost the last time they played. The so uh, the I I think that the I said this before and I'll say it again. I think that the best hope for the conference is Houston because they don't have the the baggage of having their season ended by this guy. Tua has been sent home by him. Josh has been sent home by him three times. The, Joe Burrow got sent home by him in his last playoff game. Lamar got sent home by him in his last playoff game. Trevor got sent home by him in his last playoff game. Everyone in the AFC West loses to him twice a year or once or twice a year. Like, they, they, he's the one guy who goes into it fresh like, and you ain't beat me before. 
And so they haven't even play, played him in the regular season for an opportunity for it. So I think that, I think the best hope is Houston, which means there's no hope. Thanks for watching. Subscribe here to get more from the show and to check out clips from other shows on FS1.